What you are about to see is Russian driver Artyom Severyukin. He took it upon himself on the podium to make what appeared to be a Nazi salute in celebration of his win. Here you see in plain sight his actions. Afterwards, he laughs it off. How incredibly funny to honor the genocide of six million Jewish people. Hilarious. I wonder, wasn't it the Russians who wanted to denazify Ukraine with their illegal invasion? How strikingly odd. The competition is the European Junior Karting Championship. The inhumane Russian continued laughing it off. The question remains, what will happen next? Because clearly, there was no fear for this Russian athlete. The International Gymnastics Federation has opened disciplinary proceedings against Russian gymnast Ivan Kuliak. The decision comes after the 20-year-old wore a Z symbol on his chest whilst claiming a bronze medal on the podium of the Gymnastics World Cup in Doha. Recall this Russian gymnast donning the Z logo, a letter that signals support for Russia and against Ukraine on the medal podium. Next to him, a Ukrainian athlete. At Putin's rally in a soccer stadium, there were countless Russian athletes, including an Olympic gold medalist swimmer who may have been juiced to the gills. Evgeny Rylov, we have now seen repeatedly countless Russian athletes use sport to advance the Russian dictator's agenda. So much for keeping politics out of sports, right guys? Sky News reported the FIA, motorsports governing body, said it was looking into the incident footage of which has been widely circulated and condemned on social media. The FIA confirms it has launched an immediate investigation into the unacceptable conduct of Mr. Artem Severyukin that occurred during the podium ceremony for the OK category at round one of the 2022 FIA Karting European Championship at Cardroma Internacional do Algarve in Portugal, read a statement on Monday. The FIA will communicate shortly on the further steps that will be taken in this case. Severyukin, who pounded his chest before raising his right arm, was competing in the championship with an Italian license due to the FIA's ban on Russian competitors following the country's invasion of Ukraine. The Italian national anthem was played as he made the gesture. Via the Jewish Chronicle, Ward Racing, whom Severyukin drives for, have said they will terminate his contract following the incident. The Swedish team added, Ward Racing accordingly condemns the personal actions of Severyukin during the award ceremony on April 10th, 2022 in the strongest possible terms, as it considers them a manifestation of unsportsmanlike behavior, an unacceptable violation of the ethical and moral sports codex. The thing is, the gesture is outlawed in Italy, per the Daily Mail, and could spell trouble for the Russian athlete. In the country, the far-right gesture is also frowned upon and has been illegal to perform in public since 1952, adding all forms of Nazi apologism were outlawed. His team, Ward Racing, continued their statement in lieu of this reckless behavior. Ward Racing's statement continued, they stand with the international community condemning Russia's invasion of Ukraine and expresses its solidarity with the people suffering because of this unprovoked and horrific attack. The Russian Automobile Federation informed Severyukin he was released. We also report that we consider it unacceptable. Artem himself has denied, however, that he gave a Nazi salute and instead said he was simply celebrating with his friends and family who were standing opposite the podium.